Almost a year into the pandemic and a number of local governments are still struggling economically. But Henrico County leaders are about to give big pay increases to thousands of workers. Our Brendan King spoke to the county manager. Brendan, what did you find out? Yeah, I did, Candace, and the county manager says he wants to make Henrico the next big leader of salaries in the region. He says it's been way too long since his employees were fairly compensated for their work. It's been about 10 years since they got the last big pay raise. This is my 48th year of teaching. After decades teaching science at J.R. Tucker High School. The salary over the years has been difficult to live on. Jane Selden admits the money could be better. And as a result, so many young teachers leave that are so good. They're not paid what they what they are worth, quite frankly. Tuesday night, Henrico County Manager John Vitukas proposed a $54 million plan that would provide at least 4.4% pay raises for more than 10,000 county employees. Every employee, uh, 10 plus years and more, is going to get additional compensation. Right now, the county has 450 vacancies. They slashed the budget by $100 million, stopped purchases and a number of projects in order to increase salaries. Our people, you know, we employ fewer. We ask them to do more. And so that's the premise behind this increase. If approved, county law enforcement, fire and educators and all positions will earn the highest salaries in the metro area, including Hanover, Richmond and Chesterfield. This lady in this picture, she is a 45 plus year employee of the county. She teaches biology at Tucker High School. But took his spoke about his inspirations for the proposed pay raises. She taught all of us and she's still there. So this lady changed many, many lives. His former teacher, Jane Selden. She's made an impact on so many. That's what this is about. I'm so touched. That's really sweet. She hopes the pay increases will encourage her coworkers to stay. I think it would make a huge difference. I really do. Creativity is just a... Well, the county manager says he was also thinking about other longtime Henrico police officers when creating this deal. He says those who could have retired years ago but decided to stick it out and serve the county anyway. Well, he says he does have the support of the Board of Supervisors. They are scheduled to vote on the full budget later in April. Working for you in Henrico County, I'm Brennan King, CBS 6 News.